Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Nirmal here and in this video, we'll be uh, doing a speed test comparison of two powerful uh, smartphones. So we have the IQ 11 launched uh, recently in India with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chip and this is uh, coming with up to 16 gigs of RAM and uh, here we have the iPhone 14 Pro launched uh, late last year and this comes with Apple's A16 Bionic chip uh, again a really powerful uh, device. So these are two flagship devices uh, and let's see how good are the experiences so let's uh, open uh, the 16 apps and then we'll also see the network speed so this is just an indicative test it's not a very accurate test because each app will perform differently on different platforms so you can't directly compare but still we'll uh, try to see how the speed of opening and response time and also the memory management so let's just start uh, so you can see here i've just cleared off all the background apps so we'll just uh, uh, check uh, the network connection on both the devices so there you go so you can see here we are connected uh, both the devices to the same uh, network and we have enabled the airplane mode as well so both uh, devices are in the same uh, network uh, conditions so next uh, let's uh, see the background apps so you can see here apple iphone 14 pro does not have any background apps so we'll just also see the network uh, i mean the settings about phone uh, so you can see here this is uh, android 13 and fun touch os uh, along with uh, the v2 chip and snapdragon 8 uh, gen 2 mobile platform android 13 16 gigs of ram and here we have uh, iphone 14 uh, pro so you can see here iphone 14 pro and uh, this is apple's a16 bionic and uh, the latest version of ios so we'll just clear off all the background apps uh, on uh, both the devices so you can see here everything is uh, cleared off now so let's start uh, the test and uh, we'll see how the uh, memory management of these two devices and also the speed of opening of apps. So let's start with Asphalt 9. So let's see which of uh, these devices opens Asphalt 9 faster. So you can see here uh, Apple uh, opened the game uh, faster. Uh, next is uh, Call of Duty Mobile. So here you can see that uh, IQ is uh, much faster than uh, uh, the uh, iPhone 14 Pro. Next is Play Store versus App Store. Again, uh, IQ is faster. Chrome browser. Again, uh, IQ is faster. Facebook. Facebook is slightly faster on uh, iPhone. Twitter, again IQ is uh, faster, again IQ is faster, Spotify, Spotify is faster on the iPhone, Amazon, uh, probably almost same time, not major difference, here you can see here IQ is faster, file manager, IQ is faster, settings, probably iPhone is slightly faster, YouTube, again I iPhone is faster, Gmail, uh, IQ is faster, camera almost same time and finally maps again uh, almost same time. So you can see that uh, both these devices are equally good in terms of opening of apps. There is no uh, 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 clear win actually uh, both that did a really good job here and um, uh, Apple's A15, A16 Bionic and the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 both are really powerful devices. Let's also see the memory management of these two devices uh, since both have uh, really good uh, uh, optimizations. Uh, we're hoping uh, all the apps will be in the background. So let's just uh, quickly check that. So, so far all the apps are available in the background. Uh, next, uh, let's go to uh, the social apps um, and uh, let's uh, see if uh, all of them are available in the memory. So, as of now, all the apps are available in the memory. Now, finally, uh, the games, again, uh, the games are also available in the memory and finally, Asphalt 9. So, this is also available in the memory. So, memory management seems to be really good on both the devices. So, in terms of app opening time and memory management, both are equal. Uh, we couldn't see a clear winner here. Next, let's uh, see the uh, network uh, speed. Uh, and uh, let's see uh, you can see here we are connected both the devices to the same uh, server so let's start with uh, iq so 
so here you can see that uh, almost similar speed slightly faster was iphone but again that is not a completely accurate thing uh, more or less uh, similar i would say in terms of uh, uh, speed of opening of apps so that was the speed as comparison of the iq 11 with uh, the iphone 14 pro so both of these devices are really powerful and uh, uh, produces some really great performance all, all around and the memory management and the network speed are also similar so two really powerful devices now the pricing is again the difference uh, an iphone is priced way higher than the iq 11. so hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day